today. We install the spell. Bands. Going through my head like a jet plane. Going with the lights on. Turns out it started with a fight tonight. See me in the car going right to your door. Five minutes later, I'm down on the floor. So, my fans finally rocked up. Let's get them in, get them mounted, and uh, hope nothing catches on fire along the way. Wait in them, eh? Oh, yeah. Take the leaves off, take the leaves off. Plugs. Ooh. Maybe they come with plugs. Nah. Oh, it's a good start. There is no, um... There's no male plugs for these. No extra bits. So, uh... It's a good start. Let's see if she fits on the shroud, eh? She'll do, mate. She'll do. I oh, know. Just twisted these around. Bloody lines up pretty good. You fit a bus in there. Plenty of room. Bloody meant to be. What are these? Uh, 12, 12 inch fans. And the spout. So, in case anyone's wondering, 12s, twin 12s will fit bloody great, mate. Oh. So, my, oh, my plugs. My loom, I've already got it wired up, so it's going to be roughly bloggening down this end, so... Line them, line them, these suckers up somehow to oh, get that best I can over there. Line that roughly up there. What else we got? Turn this sucker all the way around. I want it like that. That is the million dollar question. Nah, 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 nah. Turn them in there. Yeah, look. Roughly got it up, you know. We're not, we're not fucking building rocket ships here, so you know it doesn't really have to be bloody perfect, I suppose. Line that up. Line that up. It's a two finger rule, so two fingers there, two fingers there, perfect. Two fingers here. Yep. Yep. Yeah, it's bloody, bloody good all around there. Eh? It's uh, it's marks and holes, eh? So now they're all happy. I'm gonna bloody mark them out, you know, mark them out. Know what I'm doing? Get all in there. Little, little fucking. Get them, get them in there. Get them in there. 
I'll show you, I'll show you what I mean. Get a bit of a close up. Just getting the old um, focus, brother. Oh, autofocus. Nah, she doesn't want to do it. But anyway, let's just go with the the uh, Kilometrics Big Brother here. We're just bloody. I don't know if you can see in there. It's fucking in there, in there. Getting all the holes, you know. Getting uh, getting a few markings. And then what we want to do? So I don't know how I'm going to do this. And it is just get this in there. If it's even in focus, who knows, rightly. Get this in there. So we just know where we're cutting. Going to do that right around. All the rest, all the rest of these. Just so I know where I'm cutting. Cut them out. Go from there. So now they're all done, I've already bloody done around them, then the little, those little things little down here, um, I'm just going to go straight into cutting them, and the reason is that, like, this, uh, this whole measure twice, cut once thing, it's a, it's an old wives tale, and, you know, my theory is, back in the day, yeah, fair enough, fair enough, you know, we, we couldn't see shit, our, uh, our carrots, they weren't genetically modified, no, uh, GMO, no, no Monsanto, additions to to carrots so back in the day we couldn't see shit now it's the 21st century vegetables practically glow in the dark so that that transfers over to our eyes and um me i'm all about measure once cut it till it fits works out every time there you are. always good Again, always good to keep things organised, know where they are. Yeah, straight to the drill bits. Same with, uh, with this, you know. All these nice and, um, you know, nicely aligned. Say I want a, say I want a six and a half mil. Done. Just gonna get straight into this. Fucking just start drilling. Oh, safety first, every time. No, no questions asked, ever. Yeah. Well, that's not working. Something, let's try something smaller, eh? Get a bit of fucking something going on there. Oh. Um. What? Uh, what? Okay, we're off to a flying start here. Oh, well, this isn't working. It's time to bust out the uh, heavy artillery. Fuck okay, yeah, way quicker. That's bloody. Can just do this all the way around and um, I'll cut back when it's done. So see, cut it out nice and neatly. The first time you cut it, you know, uh, you want to cut it as close as you can to the line, which I've done here, nice and neatly. So you have less to uh, less to shave off, really, less to shave off. Easy in the long run, as as you might be able to see, sort of straight because I was cutting it with a knife. I've got all these straight edges, so the best way to touch that up is just. Grab a bit of sandpaper. You know, here's some. Oh, what's this, buddy? Bit of 320 grit. Goes pretty good. 320. You don't want anything coarser than that. It's just going to slide around and not do fuck all. So, just get right in there using, you know, like your fingers. Lay it on. And just start. Start touching that up there. Just round them off. Get them nice and square. Sharp edges on here. They're going to they're gonna catch on. Yeah, so as you can see, she's turned out pretty nice. Um, probably panning a bit quick there, but um, nice. You can look at that. You can rub it off. Rub it, bloody no scratches whatsoever. 
good. Now just got a process for this side and then uh, these big girls can go on. Smash this side out. It's um, a lot better on the knife. Had a bit of practice so uh, the cut was a lot bloody cleaner this time. A lot less to take out. Just had a bit of a touch up on the with the old um, the old sandpaper here. A bit of a touch up and it's come out good. So I suppose let's uh, get them on. The coating compound. Get them in these holes, you know. Get them in there. Happy day. Let's drill it. drilled in, let's mount everything up, eh? So got all uh, all the holes, buddy, drilled in here. I don't know if you can see that. All drilled in. Going to put the shroud on first in there. Then we're going to get the fans and buddy, stick them on and give it a go, you know. Already drew the holes in there, so um, get the bolts and uh, get them all done. Yeah, got the uh, got the fans installed. They bloody they bloody go alright, I tell you that much. So come have a look. Uh, as you can see there, fucking um, not much, not much room, not much room. Look, that's size of my my finger. Look, I have got snubby little fingers but bugger me she's she's tied in there so she's gonna be a she's gonna be a ripper but oh, I tell you what these things can fucking chooch some bloody wind I'll show you I'll show you ooh, ooh. I don't know if you can hear me but the wind produced from the fans here is phenomenal I'm struggling to keep my hand in place let me just show you just how these are with a quick demonstration. I've done a few calculations of um, and I've sort of come up made up this bloody um, this little house here so we all know the uh, the fairy tale well I don't even know what the fuck it's called but you know the three little piggies how they uh, is it three little pigs? I don't know the fuckers that build all the houses you know one's stick one's wood and one's brick we all know brick is fucking strong as hell so I've done this little uh, little two scale to scale, um, to weight, with precise calculations. Um, there's a scale there, 40 to one. So imagine this 40 times bigger. Um, I've added some weight on the back, you know, just to replicate what it would be scaled down. Um, and yeah, it's just in case, just so you don't know, it's a brick house. So I'm gonna be placing this, be placing this uh, in a few places and um, just seeing how how uh, how it goes really. How how the wind affects it from these bloody these bloody hooch hooch things here, eh? So I'm gonna place this down here. Turn uh, turn the fans on and just see see how strong a brick house really is, you know. Obviously a wolf can't fucking blow it down, but let's let's see what old spell can do. There you have it. I've uh, got the fans installed. They're done. I've uh, backed up some claims with uh, with science. So hopefully I've educated a few of you fellas. And uh, well, 2018. I uh, shouldn't have shooting genders. And uh, there it is. I suppose the next video is. I don't know. I suppose. Uh, 
suppose the next video, uh, we'll put some nails on it. See you in the next one.